Many companies these days are committed to become more sustainable businesses. Energy, especially electricity, is a big part of their carbon footprint. Um, so a lot of companies are establishing specific goals to procure electricity uh, from renewable energy resources. Globally, the markets are evolving, opening and with new price points, new opportunities, new technologies that are enabling them to diversify and really implement uh, a highly effective and cost-effective uh, solution portfolio for their energy needs. And nowadays, companies, food and beverage sector, finance sector, the retail sector, all these organizations are really jumping in and finding new ways and, and new kind of mechanisms to really bring renewable energy into their portfolio. Sustainability officers at times have a challenge when thinking about clean technology and renewables because of old stigmas. The myths that it's more expensive, it's not effective, it disrupts operations. When in fact, if you look across the world, it's actually the converse is true. A lot of the time comp when companies come to uh, procure renewable energy, they don't know what type of technology is the best fit for the firm. It may be a portfolio of technology and a financial structure um, that are best for them. There's so many things to consider, whether it's large-scale off-site wind to distributed generation solutions like solar on your rooftop. There's, there's a lot of inherent complexities that can uh, be visible at the surface. So one of the key things to do is help educate your organization, get the facts straight, um, rely on understanding whether it's from a procurement perspective, a sustainability perspective, a facilities perspective, what's the true inherent value, and then use that as a way to drive uh, more and more accountability and buy-in to these, these new and evolving types of solution. What's really kind of interesting and emerging over time is, is how organizations are, are using data and analytics to really run predictive analytics and, and move from more of a reactive organization that's reacting to trends, government institutions, nonprofit organizations, and moving on to more of a proactive identification of, of sustainability topics. So much has been done around techno technological feasibility, pricing, economic factors, that really integrating and diversifying an energy portfolio to include renewables, clean tech, smart grid, and other basis of solutions actually helps you operate more efficiently, save money, and help drive commitment towards sustainability goals.